What's up guys, Sunny here and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. So first of all, I'd like to start this video out by saying happy Halloween. Today is Halloween, which is totally awesome if you ask me. I am really excited about today. It's gonna be a fun day. I'm yeah, I'm just excited, wow. As you probably have read by the title already, we'll be making a pumpkin spice latte today. It is my favorite order at Starbucks, no joke. I order it pretty much all the time when it's fall because that's the only time a year they actually have it. So what better way to celebrate Halloween than with a PSL? So without further ado, let's get to the video. <laughs> Okay, so there's a few things that we gotta do first. At the beginning of Halloween, I carved a pumpkin and I actually kept the pumpkin meat from that video because I knew that I was gonna need some pumpkin for the future video. So what we're gonna have to do first is to just make the pumpkin puree. We're just basically gonna mush it and make a paste out of it. Now that we've done that and have sort of like a puree, I don't know, a paste, I don't know what to call this goo. It's literally pumpkin goo. That's what it is. Uh, we're just gonna mix everything in a pot. And um, before we do anything, I'm gonna show you guys the ingredients that we're gonna need for this recipe. So what you're gonna need is two deciliters of milk, two tablespoons of pumpkin paste, one tablespoon of honey, maple syrup, or any kind of sweetener you like. I'm using agave syrup. You also need one teaspoon of pumpkin spice, some whipped cream, I'm gonna whip it myself, one double espresso, and lastly, some caramel sauce. We're just gonna mix everything in a pot and heat it up and make an amazing latte. But before we do that, we need to make some whipped cream. Let's put together this masterpiece. All right, so the first thing you gotta do is that you have to put milk, pumpkin puree, the sweetener and the pumpkin spice into a pan. After that, you have to turn up the heat and kind of like boil the milk with all the ingredients in it. And when it's done, it starts racing and bubbling and that means that you're done and you can mix in the coffee. So in order to make the coffee, I used a double espresso shot from Nespresso. I actually borrowed my mom's coffee machine because I didn't have a double espresso, so <laughs> that works too, I guess. Then you just mix the milk and the spice and all the good stuff into the coffee and you kind of just stir it. Else it probably won't be as good as it can be, so just do that, just stir it, okay? Trust me on this one, I'm the expert. And lastly, you have to put it all together. Now this was a disaster for me because I had too much liquid in the cup, so keep that in mind if you're gonna add cream. Now let's have a little taste of this thing. The cream is kind of melted now because I had to show you guys what this actually looked like. Whoops. Wow, that is actually so good. That is actually better than the Starbucks one because the Starbucks one is way too sweet. This one is a 10 out of 10. Delicious. Now we can conclude that this was a big success. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and that you will make this recipe. If you do, please be sure to share it with me in whatever way you like. I would love to see the result and I would also love to know what you guys think. Like pumpkin spice latte is literally my favorite in the entire world. So I would really love to know what you guys think as well. Other than that, I really hope that you guys have loved Halloween. I've had so much fun filming all these videos for you guys. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to smash the like button and if you guys think that this was a success I may or may not make another one next year you know so yeah I hope you'll have a fantastic day and I'll see you guys really really soon with a brand new video bye yes.